Yo, what's going on at Phil's house? Oh, he's having a yard sale. Oh, really? We should totally go check it out. Why the hell would you want to do that? Because I just so happen to love yard sales. But you hate him. I don't hate him. Okay, I hate him, but I can totally play nice. Every time you're around him, I think you're going to punch him in the face. Because every time I'm around him, he does something horrible. Well, that's exactly my point. Like, there's no way we go over there and you don't start a fight. That's not true at all. Want to bet? What? I bet you, you can't be nice to Phil for five minutes. All right, you know what? Fine. What's the bet? This month's HOA fee. Oh, you just wait. You're going to eat those words. Right. So, five minutes? Setting a timer now. Fantastic. Let's do this. Hey, Phil. Oh, hey, hey guys. What are you doing here? Just really like yard sales. Great. Take a look around. Uh, let's see. We got uh, some candles, some old shoes. and Wait a minute. Is that canned tuna? Yes, sir. 30 bucks. For tuna? It's vintage. You mean expired? That is definitely some kind of health code violation. Wait a minute. What the hell is that? What is what? That is my leaf blower. Oh my God. I've been looking everywhere for that, you hey. mother... Joe, don't forget our bet. Son of a... God. Five minutes is ridiculous. Five minutes to what? Mm. <clears throat> okay. Phil, uh, why do you feel the need to constantly steal my stuff? I don't steal your stuff. Yes, you do. And now you're trying to sell my leaf blower. It's just to get people over to the yard sale. I wasn't actually going to sell it. It's next to a for sale sign. Trust me, I would never sell your leaf blower. Hey, I'll give you five bucks for that leaf blower. So what the hell? It was an offer I couldn't refuse. He is right, Joe. I mean, that's just smart business. Oh my God, one more minute. This is fun. I'm so glad you guys came by. Totally agree. I mean, you guys are having such a great time together. You know, Phil should join your softball team. Wouldn't that be a great idea? Oh, I'm good. Uh, as an ex-college athlete, I can't really stand playing with the... Uh uncoordinated. That actually reminds me, I saw you on your morning jog yesterday, and let me just say, those pasty legs in the short shorts, not the best combo. I mean, kids live on this street. Oh, and, and speaking of kids, you know, your son, the uh, chubby ginger, he really needs to start some sort of exercise regimen, because I know early onset diabetes when I see it, and he's like one Snickers bar away. I mean, honestly, <laughs> wait, what the hell is that? Is there a timer going on? Looks like my five minutes are up, Phil. What do you mean? I mean, now I can say whatever the hell I want. No, Joe, please don't. Ever since you moved into the neighborhood, my life has been a living hell. No, no, scratch that. Everybody's life. That's not true. I mean, the freaking property values have plummeted because between your personality and your BO, nobody wants to live around you. Oh, and newsflash, Everybody can see inside your living room windows. So, as somebody that looks like a human jar of mayonnaise, maybe do your naked Pilates else. Please stop! Oh, I am not stopping. Not until you move out or drop dead. Oh, and if you're confused about which one of those to choose, maybe ask one of your friends that we both know you don't have. Oh, are you sad? Does the truth hurt your little feelings? <laughs> Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Run away, you little... Wow, okay, uh, feel better? Well, I made Phil cry and I won the bet, so yeah. Feel pretty great. Yeah, but still, that sucks about your leaf blower. Oh, nah, that's fine. It is? Yeah, you don't remember? I borrowed that leaf blower from you. 